Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. I know I'm being a little weird. I'm sorry. It's late. I'm up by myself. Um, so it's just me and yeah, so I'm a little whatever. I've had too much coffee. Anyhow, um, today I'm going to do the lip addict tag. Um, I have a ton of lip products and as you all know, I've said it many, 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 many times before. I don't wear makeup a whole, whole lot. Um, I would say I wear makeup probably only like once a week. So, and I know every time you see me, majority of the time, I am wearing makeup. And that's because when I have a chance to film, I will film like no shit, like seven or eight videos in a day, knock them all out. And that, that'll actually last me for a few weeks. I can edit them and upload them every like two to three days and I'm good to go. So I don't wear makeup a whole lot and I don't go, I don't go out a whole lot either just because, you know, I have young kids and it's no fun to drag a hyperactive three-year-old out in public. Uh, yeah, that's a huge challenge all in itself. So anyway, enough of the rambling. Let's get on into the Question tag. number one is, what is your best lip balm or lip treatment? And I actually received this in one of my, I believe one of my birch boxes. And this is the Dr. Lip Original Nipple Balm for your lips. It's 100% natural. It looks like this. And I don't even know how to describe this. It's a super thick product that when you apply it to your lips, so I'm going to give you a little swatch here. It's, it's very sheer. So I'm going to try to put enough on my hand for you to see it. But it's super thick and super, can you see that? It's right here on my hand, right here. So it's got this yellow tintish color to it, but it's kind of like a, um, I mean, I don't know if you guys can see how it's like stretching. It's like super thick. It moisturizes your lips for hours. Like I, I like to put it on at night and it is super thick and super sticky, but I mean, it's just so silky and smooth on the mouth. And I mean, your lips will be so soft. I mean, hello, if it's to treat your nipples, I mean, come on now. So yeah, if you can't get your hands on this, you can get like the, I believe it's called Lanso or, Lan I think it's called Lanso. It's a nipple cream that you can get at like Walmart, CVS, Walgreens, any place like that. But yeah, get your hands on some nipple cream girls and rub it on your lips and tell me what you think. I promise you, you won't regret it. Hmm. Number two, the question is, what is your best eye catching red? So, you know I always have to be different, so, because I am different, um, I brought two. Um, and I have many, many options that I can really choose from, but I just grabbed two that I've I have most read, and then I have a glossy type of red. So I'm going to swatch them both. The first one I'm going to show is the Elf Matte Lip Color, and it's one of these pencil type things. Actually, they're both in a pencil form. And this is in the shade Rich Red. So... That's the e.l.f. one here. Sorry, it's upside down. So this is in the shade Rich Red. And it's just a twist up type of pencil, as you can see. And it's very, very beautiful. So that is the swatch there on my lips. I'm not wearing it today. I'm actually wearing a Wet n Wild product with a gloss on top. Um, I did a tutorial on this look that I'm wearing now, so if you want to check it out, of course, I'll leave it in the description box. And uh, my glossy or shiny or whatever you want to call it, red, is this Urban Decay Super Saturated High Gloss Lip Color. And this is in the shade Theodora. And this is part of the Great, um, the great and Powerful Oz collection that Urban Decay, Urban Decay, oh my god. Urban Decay came out with a few years ago. I don't know if this is still available, but this is not a twist up crayon. This one does have to be sharpened, but this shade is wholly pigmented. This is it here. It's the shiny one. I just want, I'm, I'm going to swatch it again because I did it off camera, but I just want you to see how pigmented this crayon is. I mean, hello. Look at that. Imagine this on your lips. I don't care what kind of lips you got. 
you wear this crayon and you're going to turn some heads. Okay? So yeah, I really, really like this one and it does last for a very long time. Again, that's the Urban Decay Super Saturated so, um, Lip Crayon. And what, what question am I on? Question number three is what is your best luxury and best drugstore product? So for luxury, I'm going to have to go with my um, Chanel lip liner or lip definer um, pencil in nude. Yes, that just happened. Am I still in focus? Oh, shit. I get, look how long my hair's gotten, y'all, for real. If you've watched some of my very first videos, my hair was literally like way up here. I had an A-line bob and the front part came to like right here. It was very, very short and stacked in the back. Like they used um, men's uh, electric shaver or razor, whatever you want to call it. And it was stacked and then it came down to like a point right here. And look how much it's grown. And I've started my YouTube channel in March. So, I mean, it's it's grown about five to six inches just since March. So, hey, <laughs> I can't wait because I want to play with it. And I just feel like it's at that in-between stage where it's just like no fun to play with. Anyway, damn, I'm super off track. Okay, so going back to this uh, Chanel lip definer in nude, it looks like this. And on this pencil um, thingy here, you get the actual product here. So even though it says nude, um, you can obviously see, see I've got that, what you call it on there, so I don't want to color on top of it. But as you can see, it does have nice color to it, but for my skin type and my skin tone, not skin type, my skin tone, this is actually a really good nude for my lips because uh, my lips are very pigmented anyway. So with the tone of my skin, um, this nude is actually a really good product, it matches my skin tone very well and this is in the shade 05 nude um, but on the other end you get a lip brush so you can you know blend blend am I making a mess so that is my yes. best high-end um, product that I have so for drugstore I'm gonna have to go with my holy grail lipstick and this is by L'Oreal and it's the Collection Purve by J. Lo. Looks like this. And this is in the shade Jennifer's Nude. And I love me some of this lipstick. So that's what the color looks like here. I'm not left-handed, so this feels weird. But I'm going to swatch it. And I love this on my lips because it's just the right amount of nude without making me look dead, if you know what I'm saying. Okay, question number four is what is your favorite MAC lipstick? And um, I've been living under I've been living under a rock for like the last 37 years. I don't own a MAC lipstick. I've never owned a MAC lipstick. I do plan on purchasing some here in the near near future. Um, I've actually been saving all of my other MAC um, uh, what do you call it? like packaging so I can do my back to Mac I just there isn't a Mac store that's like really close to me so there are so many great drugstore art alternatives and plus there's a Sephora right down the street for me so you know I do have high-end lipsticks I just don't have any Five. Mac is what is your most disappointing product what is your most disappointing lip product okay so that's gonna have to be this one um, and not that there's anything wrong with the product. I'm just disappointed because it really makes me look like I am laying in a coffin. This is the Maybelline. What line is this? Does it even say? Yes, this is part of the limited edition um, line. But this is one of their Color Sensational um, lipsticks. And it's in the shade Raw Reveal. And this, uh, this actually came out not too long ago, and I really should have saved the receipt so I could have, um, like, get a refund or exchange it for something else. But going back to that Jennifer's Nude, which, let me just, let, first, first let me just talk about this really quick. Okay, so that's what it looks like. I mean, can you see that? It is the exact same color as, like, my skin. Can you see that? It's like the exact same color as my skin. So if there wasn't like this contrast going on with this packaging, you probably wouldn't even be able to see this. 
So I'm just going to put it on. As you can see, I'm putting a big swatch next to that. And you can't see shit on my hand. You can't see it. Like, where's it at? When I put it on, like I said, I have very pigmented lips. So when I apply this to my mouth, and the formula feels great. It smells great. It feels great. But you just, I can't see it. So when I put it on over my lips, it looks like I have, like, no color to my mouth at all. And it's just, it's not pretty. It's not flattering. It's not pretty. And I refuse to wear it. Um, the question is, lip liner yes or no and I'm definitely gonna say yes uh, I like to use lip liner no matter what shade of lipstick I'm wearing uh, I guess just depending on what I'm doing if I you know day to day I don't really need to use a lip liner I mean day to day I don't wear makeup anyway but yes I do enjoy wearing a lip liner I think it makes your lipstick excuse me my husband just coughed I think it makes your lipstick um, last a lot longer and a lot of times you can actually change the shade of your lip product by applying a lip liner underneath. So yes, I say yes. Number seven is what is your favorite lip gloss or best lip gloss? And I talked about this in my favorites as well. This is by Victoria's Secret and it looks like this. Looks like this. And this is in the shade um, Sublime and it has a doe foot applicator and I'm wearing it today. And this is just one of those colors that no matter what kind of lip product you're wearing, you can top it on top of it and it just, you know, it, it goes well. It pairs well with anything. A nude, a pink, a red. It doesn't matter. It's going to give you nice shine and it lasts okay, pretty long Number eight well. is something extra. So I had to bring two. So first I'm going to talk about this. This is an e.l.f. product. It is um, a lip exfoliator and it can look scary to a lot of people. Um, it's like this greenish like this army greenish brown kind of color and it's got a lot of brown like speckles all over it and so the bullet is actually really moisturizing and the little brown things that you see is actually sugar like brown sugar so when you put it on your lips it really gets all that it sloughs off the dead skin off your mouth and it tastes good as well because you know it's sugar so I like to put this on at night and it really gives you um, really soft lips when you wake up in the morning and who doesn't want Kiss the last thing is right? this Exude is the brand. Comes in a little box. It's fancy schmancy. And this is actually a like a lipstick. What is it? What is this exactly called? Lip cream. It's a lip cream and it comes packaged in this box and this is just foam. And this bullet, let me just show you this bullet. It is I've never seen anything like this and this is in the shade Plum. So this is what it looks like and as you can see the bullet is glass and it has a hole in the top so it's kind of like a liquid excuse me I just burped my husband's in there sneezing bless you babe so the bullet is glass it has a hole in the top so when you twist um, What's that noise? Sound like a whistle. Is that you? Okay, so when you twist it up, it comes out of the hole and it's like a like a liquid lipstick. I mean I'm gonna swatch it for you so you can see what it looks like. Um this is a high-end product, so it's not cheap. Uh oh, I think I've twisted too much. Hold on. So I'm gonna swatch it right here. It's a gorgeous shade, perfect for fall great for winter um, so that's it right here so it's just a nice plum color and like I said I've never seen anything like this as far as like the packaging goes I think it's great um, so yeah but this is by the brand Exude if I can remember um, I know you can go to exude.com or whatever and purchase this but if I can find the link to where you can get this product I'll leave it in the description right, box guys, so that's check. everything for this tag I hope you enjoyed it don't forget to give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I'll see you in the next video bye